Ready? Yep. All right, so this is a &P assignment four. I've got my notes here, but I've also submitted them to turn it in. Um, I'm just gonna show you kind of the format of how that looks. It's obviously a discussion. Uh, the first thing you would need to do is talk to me about ATP and the breakdown to ADP. So you might have a, I'll give you a whiteboard pen and you can come up and you can go, right, this is adenosine and these are three phosphate molecules. And what happens here is we have an enzyme, which is called ATPase, and that comes and breaks this high energy bond. And when that happens, that produces energy. Right. Then I would move on to the creatine phosphate system. And I would talk about how the creatine phosphate system produces energy, how, how much energy that system produces, and I might even document on it. So I'll go, right, okay, well, there's a C and a P, and when creatine kinase breaks this bond, it then resynthesizes ATP. I'd also talk about every time that does it, it only produces one ATP. I talk about how much energy in terms of time it produces and the recovery time of that system. If there are any waste products, I'd also talk about that. Finally, I'd talk about the sport it's suitable for and why. I'd then move on to the lactic acid system and then finally I would do the aerobic system. If I'm going for the distinction, that's the bit where I'm talking about the energy systems in relation to the athletes and I'm talking about the advantages of the energy system in relation to the athlete and their performance and the limitations of the energy systems in relation to the athlete and their performance. Okay, There is a model answer which is on the PowerPoint uh, for energy systems in sport. I shared it with you, I did it on Andy Murray but I only based it on the creatine phosphate system so you would need to then go on and talk about Andy Murray and the lactic acid system and Andy Murray and the aerobic system. Okay, and then apply that principle to two other athletes. That is your assessment. Okay, there's kind of a walkthrough of how to do it. There's the start, here's my notes. They're on, turn it in, I'm ready to go. Let's go distinction, guys.